time to show the Xbox some TLC. Whoever said I wasn't an Xbox fan? True Gamer here and I'm back with another episode. Every sealed game that I get and I add to my collection I'm going to be doing an update video. Same as what I do with my PS4 collection videos. Okay let's start with exclusives first. This is Rise Son of Rome and it's from the wonderful Crytek. This guys was a launch title and it can be pretty pricey to get a sealed copy of this these days. And this game is top quality and a must play for all Xbox owners. Next up is Sunset Overdrive and this is another blockbuster from the infamous developers Insomniac and it's an absolute gem which I have to jump back into and play pretty soon. It's just pure zombified head popping action from start to finish. Then we have Killer Instinct Combo Breaker Pack which is very rare to get in the physical form and it was developed by Double Helix and Iron Galaxy. Now I love and I grew up with 2D fighting games so this kind of game is tailor made for a gamer like myself. Street Fighter still remains the GOAT but um, yeah this game is far from shabby guaranteed you'll have a fun fest time with Killer Instinct especially if you like that kind of genre. Next up we have Gears 5 Ultimate Edition from The Coalition and as you see we have Kate Diaz on the front looking rather glossy and there's the back. When I initially bought this I didn't know it was on Game Pass until the very last minute but good thing I found out before I broke the seal so this silky sealed plastic will remain and I've got to add it comes with a stunning looking still book. Now this is very precious and what this is is Ori and the Willow of the Wisps Collector's Edition. Now for a Collector's Edition the price of this was extremely reasonable so I just had to lap this up. Plus no need to break the seal because it's on that wonderful Game Pass ecosystem. It's tempting to, uh, to open it and have a quick flick through of the artwork but maybe one day and what comes with this is a still book case, game, the game, art book, piano collection music CD and the original soundtrack uh, music mp3 download. So there you have it, Ori and the Widow of the Wisps collector's edition. My last exclusive which I don't know is an exclusive anymore and that is Dead Rising 4 from the legendary developers Capcom. Now Capcom has been the GOAT in the gaming industry for decades and Dead Rising is just another zombie packed action game which is quite entertaining in its own right. Then we have Doom 2016 and this is by Bethesda which is now Microsoft's property for a 7 point billion smackaroos. Now don't need to really explain this game it's just hair raising action from the time you press start on your controller. Next we have Bard's Tale 4 and this is the Director's Cut Day 1 Edition and it's from the developers Deep Silver who absolutely smashed it with this action RPG and I can't wait to spend more precious time with this that's for sure. Next in line is Indivisible and this was created by 505 Games. Now this game is right up my street, I love RPGs, I adore platforming and Indivisible are them two genres rolled into one. Haven't played it yet but I certainly will in the up and coming future. Now this is Mutant Football League Dynasty Edition and it's from Nighthawk Interactive. So I guess this is just a bunch of monsters playing American football. I saw this for cheap so I just thought to myself why not grab it. Then we have Destiny 2 from Bungie which I used to play this game religiously but after time I fell out of love with it. 
I got it on so many platforms uh, I decided to keep this one sealed and last but not least is Call of Duty World War 2 and this is from Sledgehammer and Activision had this on my PS4 so I didn't bother playing on my Xbox had a lot of fun and this is a great addition to the Call of Duty series and proof is in the pudding that these are all sealed because they have their security tab barcodes attached to each individual case as you can see so that's it guys that's a quick look at my Xbox One sealed collection now don't listen to the whispers I have plenty of love for Xbox if you want to see my Xbox hardware collection I will leave a link in the description down below and what it is in that video you will see all my machines across the generation not just Xbox One you have what's, what's, what's been before and what is now okay guys if you like the video give me a thumbs up even better subscribe till next time see ya